Hey everyone, welcome to another challenge mode, do as I command one. This time we're gonna do that on Willow. On Willow we get some nice looping spots and it starts in the basement with the summoning cycle. Okay, nice objectives. We need eight more photos. So, um, the goal is we get all the cursed possessions in this difficulty, in this challenge mode. And uh, we're gonna take photos of all of them and we're gonna use the summoning cycle to get our ghost photo. And we're gonna loop the ghost through the whole house using the salt and sensors and flashlights and stuff like that. So it's gonna be fun. Let's see how it goes. Okay, I forgot again what, where the breaker was, but it's fine. We're gonna take those photos. I hope this won't block line of sight for this. No, it doesn't. Okay. It's invisible <laughs> for the camera. Okay, uh, we don't have a hiding spot here, but that's fine. We're gonna loop the ghost anyways. Oh, we got the breaker right here. Nice. We got two cursed possessions in here. Oh, and a bony pants. Nice. Okay. I placed the lantern because eh, because of this. <laughs> okay, let's take this. Oh, we don't have my favorite hiding spot here. Oh. But like I said, we can loop the ghost. That's totally fine. Ghosty goo, where are you? Okay, we got our monkey paw right here. Hello. How are you doing, mister? Oh, you are right here. Okay. I think Voodoo Doll is the only one left and the summoning cycle in the basement, of course. Did I miss one? No, we got the music box. Wait. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, and summoning cycle would be seven. I didn't count the bone, of course. Hello, Ghosty Goo. How is your day going? Hope you're having a nice day. Always be nice to our ghosty pants. I hope it won't change room that quickly. So I haven't used any sanity yet. So it should be fine. Let's bring in a crucifix ASAP in case we get a demon or something. So we don't have any good hiding spots. We got those two bad hiding spots. Didn't I turn on the lights here? Let's grab a crucifix, grab the camera and grab a book as usual because those take some time. And so we got a basic setup. I don't see an orb. Oh, there's an orb. Okay, we got orbies. Nice. Let's first place this. My god, the tier 3 crucifix has an insane range. So it could technically still be a mimic. We have to check that. So let's check right away for spirit box and UV. I'm gonna put those for the ghost highway. I'm gonna put one over here. Uh oh, it threw something back there. I hope it's still here. Wait, we can also check it touched. Oh, we got thingies. Okay, could be a mimic still. Oh, it's right there. It's right there. Damn it, I need a spirit box. Give me the spirit box. That's why I set the sensor there, you know, to test for... Uh, to test for it right away. That, 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 that. Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you a child? See, that's a good trick to use the spirit box and... Whoa! And a sensor. Okay, now we just need freezing. If we get freezing, it's a mimic. Wait. Okay, let's... Oh, feet! You see that nice little feet? Feet! <laughs> okay. It can only be a mimic. That's it. Okay, it can be everything. We have to be careful with this ghost. <laughs> We have to be so careful, it could mimic a demon, it could mimic um, a teleporting ghost, and then uh, it could mimic again something else. <laughs> so let's set up this looping spot here. <sighs> Damn it, but I wanted to be slowed when it comes up from the basement, so maybe put this here so it won't step in it now. This one here so we can see it coming up the stairs. Oh this there i think we're gonna put some smudges on uh, the kitchen aisle here so we can grab them in case we need them um, we're gonna need a flashlight down there for sure mm, put this here so we can see something this and the smudge next to it the flashlight here so this is uh, my setup for 
the ghost highway up this one here so we can see the ghost approaching we can put the uv over here so we can see the feet maybe a bit further to the front if it steps in this we can see the feet coming towards us we put this one here just in case the ghost gets too fast emf i don't know if we need emf i just do it because i have the chance right here mm -hmm. because sometimes we have no we don't have that objective okay it's fine so we know it's a mimic that's fine mm get a sensor here we got one sensor there can place one sensor here so we know it's there hey don't destroy my ghost highway don't you dare don't you dare mimicking like a stalking ghost all of a sudden don't you dare ghosty <laughs> okay so let's put one here and one like here so we can see the ghost shadow okay so we got those set up we need some in the basement um, we should have freezing but we don't have to check that okay we need a ghost photo and we can take one photo later on we have to repel we have to cleanse we need sanity where's my sanity the sanity is here um, I guess I'm gonna leave the crucifix in this area here. Let's grab this. Okay. It might come over here and destroy this, but it's fine. We can use that salt on the fly, maybe. And I'm gonna put this flashlight here so I can see it approaching. Okay, we got those. We got the camera. Let's get ready. Damn it, my salt! Don't you dare, ghosty. Hey, buddy! It's you, huh? I didn't see you there for a second. Are you a party? Oh my god, look at that table, it's cleared! <laughs> oh my god, see, there are the footprints, see? <laughs> oh, this is so cool. Okay, we got the ghost photo. Um, we just have to take one last photo and we're fine. Let's do not uh, the wrong decision. Let's just take a salt photo. This should be enough. <laughs> okay, do we have salt here? No, I didn't place salt here, but we got some here. Nice. We got all the photos. Great. Thank you, ghosty. Whoops. It closed the doors. Have a good one. <laughs> okay, <laughs> another nice one. We could loop the ghost uh, through the whole map. <laughs> this was cool using all the salt and oopsie we need to drain sanity okay we don't have a good hiding spot though hmm. do i have some more smudgies i may use the music box here i mean there's a crucifix here it might prevent the hunt right the crucifix right here if the ghost hasn't changed room Just to be safe. Stop it! Don't do this. I want to use the music box. I think it mimicked the poltergeist. You see that? This whole thing is empty. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Willow, we're gonna listen to some nice music. Okay, Ghosty, don't do the event. Don't be here. Don't you dare. You hear him singing? singing? Come on, Sanity Dwayne. And there we go. Sanity is gone. 
If you go further away, it stops the sanity drain, and if you get closer again, it continues. And my sanity is gone. Did it use the crucifix? It used the crucifix up. As you can see, Curse Hunt is being stopped completely by the tier 3 crucifix, but it's also all the two charges will be used up in one go, if it prevents a Cursed Hunt. Some people think it has three charges. It kind of would make sense, actually, because the first one has one, the second one has two, but it's not the case. The difference between tier 2 and tier 3 is tier 3 has the higher range and tier 3 has the same amount of charges, but it can prevent a cursed hunt just like this. You saw it right here. Okay, Mimic, everything has been done. Let's go. So the last evidence would have been freezing. And if we remove the orb, we have the Mimic. Because for the Mimic, the orb is more like an ability instead of an evidence. But it looks like the normal evidence orb. So you have to test for those other three remaining evidence, which would be freezing thingies and spirit box, to make sure that it's either not a mimic or that it's actually a mimic, like in this case. Okay. So it has changed ghost type 10 times. And I think during the hunt, it was a poltergeist. At least it looked like it. So that was it for Willow. I hope you liked it. See you in the next one. Bye.